Blink Cincinnati is coming back and covering even more territory. The record-setting lights festival that launched in 2017 will be back October 10th to 13th, 2019, and will cross the Roebling Suspension Bridge into Covington, in addition to its stops in the Central Business District and over the Rhine. The event partners that made the announcement last week, Brave Berlin and Agar, are two companies that help make Blink happen. Steve McGowan is an owner and partner at Brave Berlin, and Josh Huser is a co-founder and owner at Agar. They are with Business Courier editor Rob Dahmeyer in the studio. Gentlemen. Okay, thank you guys both. Thank you so much for being here. Thank, thank you. you. Um, last year, obviously, it was the talk of the year, I think, in Cincinnati. Uh, I'm not uh, trying to kiss up to you guys by saying that. <laughs> it, was a, it was a huge, huge success. Uh, zero arrests, a million people came down. But how does that work? How do you, how do you get a million people into the city? Uh, we're going to do this again next year. Yeah, so it's funny because we, um, we kind of thought, we knew that we were going to have big crowds, you know, just based on um, even luminosity and the popularity of that as an art form. Uh, and I think once people started getting what it was, because that was the big mystery, like what is Blink and, and you know, what, what is this thing that we're going to see? Um, but I think ultimately when we um, created something that people could find their way into, um, everybody did that. And so by just sort of getting the word out and getting um, the amazing sponsors that we had, yeah. um, people were able to sort of imagine kind of an, a, a new future city for Cincinnati. And totally pushing the boundaries on creativity, um, taking risks, um, and also getting the community, you know, buy-in. Um, I think it all really kind of culminated with the, with the opening night parade when we all kind of looked out and was like, whoa, the city, they received it, they made it their own. Um, and they shared it and really um, took in the excitement. Yeah, yeah I, I barely remember the 1990 World Series when the Reds won, but I can tell you that I have not s seen people as excited just to talk about that event last year as I could when a, when a sports team here won a major title. Um, wanted to ask you guys about Northern Kentucky. You're spreading in, uh, across the river this year. That's a big deal. How's that, how's that going to work? Uh, well, I'm really excited about moving into Northern Kentucky, being a, a native of, of Independence, Kenton County, taking it over into Covington, yeah. um, adding a fifth zone um, that we believe is going to stretch up to um, Braxton Brewery. Oh, wow. um, and really, you know, the amount of people that walk the streets of Cincinnati never been done before previously. And now we're going to bring that over to Covington, and people are literally going to cross the bridge. And it truly makes it a regional event versus just a Cincinnati event. And I think that's what we're really yeah. excited about. It's, it's by design, too, that uh, we've created these neighborhoods. It helps with navigation where people can park. You know, last year there was some congestion in the city, obviously. Some people thought they could come down and, and drive to see everything oh. like you would, you know, like a, yeah. you know, a chair in woods and a light show like that. Right. But this is some, something completely different. So the idea was you could park anywhere, hop on and off the streetcar, or just we're such a walkable city. Um, but I think by adding that fifth neighborhood, too, what it does, it does stretch it all out for us. Um, it'll disperse the crowd a little bit more, too. But... Um, it's so amazing because we, right before the parade started, we were getting a little nervous because we're like, it's five o'clock and I, I don't, the streets aren't full. Like, what's right. happening? And yeah. then, bam, it just happened. It, just it was just floods the floodgates, yeah. 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 Right. And then the spirit was there, and like you said, there were no incidents at all. And it was just people just having a shared, when people have a shared moment of art, that's when it, that's when it changes. That's when people forget yeah. about all it's the other stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It truly is. Um, I, it's a lot of work. I can't even begin to imagine how much work this is, how much creative work this is. Um, but I do have a last question for you. It's, what are you looking forward to? And, and don't, the answer can't be when it's over, because that's, <laughs> yeah. that's not a fun well, answer. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think we're just looking forward to seeing the crowds, you know, come back. It's, you know, we found out in, in our research previously is that it's in our human DNA to explore darkness through light. Um, and people genuinely really do take this upon their own. And seeing um, the streets filled in Covington, like they were in Cincinnati. I, I don't want to ex expand the crowd. I want to bring more people in. And I think we all want to do that yeah. as a group and truly make this not only a regional event, but a national event for our, for our city. Yeah, we have shined the light on Cincinnati. We are an international city, and people are talking about us. And this event is blowing up in a really great way. And I think that uh, I'm looking forward to the, the creative that we have yet to see. Uh, we don't know what we don't know yet. We, we have um, artists, there are a lot of, uh, Agar's bringing a, a ton of international street artists in. Um, Artworks is hard at work now too, sort of, you know, getting their 
uh, groups and their artists together. Uh, all of our artists get paid, so that's a that's unique for something like yeah. this. So yeah. I just can't wait to see what they come up with, and it's going to be completely different than last year. Uh, we're absolutely looking forward to it. We appreciate you both being here, and good luck over the next year. And we can't wait to see what you come up with. Thanks a lot, guys. Yeah, book your hotel rooms now. It's yeah, getting crazy, big time. Thank you. Thanks.